Hi guys, today I'm here to talk about arching rod and the difference between arching rod and UL rod. Uh, UL rod actually derives from the word ultra light. Uh, ultra light game has already evolved into a few different types of uh, categories. They have the arching rod, the Mebaru rod, and the stream rods for trout fishing. These are all categorized under UL, so it's a definition of uh, different types of games. Okay. Here with me, I have our very own Extreme Angler Custom Arching Rod which is a uh, 5 feet 7, comes in 2 piece and it's 45 gram in total uh, comes with Torsite guides Fitted with the Fuji Titanium Torsite guides and the tip is super fine I don't think the camera can focus on such a small thing uh, it's size 3 and 3 and 3 and 3 then 3.4 and then all the way to the end ok the blank is actually 99% carbon it is very strong but yet very thin you can hear it actually it's very thin it's hollow through infused to a solid carbon which is actually quite sensitive yet very thin, very stiff it is only 0.7mm the guides are fitted with a titanium torsite AT guide you can see very sensitive and small very thin it has the Fuji skeleton reel seat which is minimalized just enough to fit a 1000-2000 size reel for 2021 we have a new feature for the arching rod which is the hollow butt you see yeah this one helps transmit all the bumps from the rod it helps give more sensitivity to the angler which is very important okay after after saying all this actually what is the big fuss about being super sensitive and super light Simply because arching anglers needs to work small little jig like this. They are they probably need to work from 0 0.3 gram to maybe 1.8 gram. So sensitivity and the lightness helps in feeling everything. So I hope you understand more about arching fishing and enjoy the video. I'll see you guys again. Bye.